Hello, I'm your host Priyanka Rachaya and I welcome you to today's episode of MBTV Project Review. Jakkur, earlier known for its air shows, boasts of one of the biggest and cleanest lakes in the city. It also houses one of the oldest flying schools in the country. The locality today is a hotbed for real estate investment in North Bengaluru. Many developers are coming up with projects here and one among those is Affinity Brindavana. Come, let's head to Jakkur today and check out what the project offers. Affinity Brindavana is situated in Sampige Halli of Jakkur Road and offers a total of 190, 1, 2 and 3 bedroom apartments. There will be a total of two towers with tower A being a stilt plus basement plus 7 floor structure. There will be a total of 58 units in this tower with 8, 2 and 3 bedroom units on each floor. Tower B will be a basement plus stilt plus 7 floor structure with a total of 132, 1, 2 and 3 bedroom units and there will be 17 units per floor. There will be a total of 211 covered car parking spaces with one car park space provided per unit. The project sources water from borewells and BWSSB. It's BBMP and RERA approved and is expected to be completed by April 2026. This is the master plan of the project uploaded on the RERA website. The project has a single entry and exit point with two towers placed adjacent to each other. In between the two towers, a proposed road is likely to come up. These are the typical flow plans of Block A and Block B. As you can see, there are 8 units in Block A out of which the corner ones are 3 bedroom units which are independent with no shared walls and the rest are 2 bedroom configurations with shared walls. Block A has 2 staircases and 2 lifts. In Block B, you will find 17 units per floor. Out of the 17, 11 units are independent with no shared walls and 6 are 3 bedroom units. There will be 3 staircases and 3 lifts in Block B, out of which 2 are likely to be passenger lifts and 1 service or emergency lift. The project is situated close to Greenfield Public School and Jakku Lake 2 is just around 700 meters and 2 minutes away from the project. The project is around 5 kilometers and 13 minutes away from Kogilu Cross, which is a point of intersection on Balari Road. The stretch which runs from Sampige Halli Main Road to the project near the back gate of Greenfield Public School was untarred and muddy when we visited the project. Nonetheless, it's likely to be asphalted before the possession of the project. Now let's check out the floor plans of units at Affinity Brindavana. In this one bedroom apartment, as soon as you enter, you will find an L-shaped living come dining area with an attached balcony. The drawing or dining room further opens up to the kitchen and a bedroom that comes with an attached bathroom. In this two bedroom apartment, you will find a drawing room as soon as you enter. Moving ahead, the drawing room leads you to the dining area that comes with an attached balcony. The dining room further opens up to two bedrooms that come with attached bathrooms and a kitchen that has an attached utility area. This three bedroom apartment has a drawing room, a dining area with an attached balcony, kitchen with a utility area and three bedrooms that come with three attached bathrooms. One thing that I observed after going through the floor plans of the project is that the developer has completely done away with the concept of a common bathroom and has provided attached bathrooms in all the rooms. 
As per the RERA website, the amenities that will be provided by the developer will include CCTV surveillance, a clubhouse, outdoor sports facilities, swimming pool and a gym. Let's now check out the project's access to employment centers, social, retail and commercial infrastructure facilities. The most advantageous feature of this project is its connectivity to Tanisandra Main Road. Tanisandra Main Road, which leads to Maniata Tech Park Back Gate, is just around 2.2 km and 6 minutes away. Maniata Tech Park is around 4 km and 11 minutes away in normal traffic conditions. Other nearby employment hubs include companies and business parks along Balari Road like Kirloskar Tech Park and Brigade Ecopolis. Sampike Halli Main Road, Agrahara Main Road, Vidyar School Road, Tanisandra Main Road and Balari Road are the major stretches of connectivity. The Kempegowda International Airport is 21 km and 31 minutes away from the project. BMTC buses, cabs and autos are easily accessible from the Sampige Halli or the Agrahara main roads. Greenfield Public School is the nearest educational institution which is just a hop away. Vipgyor High School in Chokkanahalli is 1.6 km, Vipgyor School in Jakkur is 3.4 km and Wisdom Montfort International School is around 4 km away. Reputed hospitals like Manipal, Astor CMI, Bangalore Baptist and Rainbow Children's Hospital on Balari Road are anywhere between 7 to 10 km away. Retail facilities available on Agrahara Main Road will be your nearest go-to place for routine shopping. Apart from this, you can head to Balari Road for any major retail requirements. ST Mall and Elements Mall are the nearest shopping and entertainment destinations. There is a sunset and lake watch tower and a scenic abandoned quarry which is called as Choti Nandi Hills within 5 to 10 minutes reach of the project. Number of units, their super built up areas and prices exclusive of GST are as mentioned on the screen. The GST amount will come up to an additional sum of rupees 2.35 to 4.66 lakhs. Mithuna White Pills, Provident Harmony, Provident Neora, Nakshatra Celestia and Purple Garden Apartments are some of the residential constructions close to the project. For more such information about many more projects in Jakkur, Sampike Harli and surrounding areas, log in to www.magicbricks.com. When we compare the project pricing with that of the average locality price range, we observe that the pricing of 1, 2 and 3 bedroom units are well within the ambit of the average locality range. There is not much information about the developer on the internet. According to the information provided by the builder on the RERA website, Affinity Serenity in Yalahanka is the only other project built by the developer in the past five years. To sum it up, Affinity Brindavana certainly has a locational advantage due to its proximity to Maniata Tech Park. Further, the project is situated in a developing locality with many residential constructions around, mirroring the demand for properties in the area and also signifying the scope for improvement in terms of infrastructure facilities like tarred roads. This means you can buy a property here for both investment and end use. So this was my review of Affinity Brindavana. Hope you liked it. In case you did, give us a thumbs up and share the video. Also, subscribe to MBTV to watch more such project reviews from across the country. This is Priyanka Rachaya signing off with camera person Pragat.